Hi, I'm Reggie with Stub Grayson's. In this video, I will show you two ways how to add transition in Final Cut Pro. So let's get it on! Okay, let's start with the first method. So once you have your clips on your timeline, just go through your transitions browser over here, just click it. And then you have a plethora of built-in transitions here. Okay, these are all free, including in Final Cut Pro. Let's select lights, maybe using lights. And then you can just drag it to your clip in between of your clips. And you now have your transition right there. Oh, nice. You can also select the edge of your clip right here. It can be the first or the second clip. There should be a yellow line on the edge. It should not be a whole box, okay? Not like this yellow box. It should be one line like this, okay? And then once you've just selected your clip, you can just double click the transition on your transition browser right here. Double click. Okay, you now have your transition right there. Nice. Okay, by the way, you can also copy your transitions by selecting the transition and then hitting command C and then selecting the clip and then command V. Okay, for the second method, go to your transition browser and then select any transition you want. Let's use light lens flare and then right click and then make default and then go to your timeline and then select your clip and then hit command T. And then that will be your default transition. By the way, you should select the edge of your clip and not the full clip, okay? Or else the transitions will be inserted on both sides, like so. Okay! By the way, if you run into this error, there's not enough extra media beyond clip edges to create transition. Just select create transition, okay? It will just ripple trim your clip, will remove 12 frames. Okay, so to add a transition, you have a minimum of two frames on both sides. One, two. Then from the playhead, one, two frames. Then I'm gonna trim it. And then I'm gonna put a transition right here. You can insert a transition if you have a two frames on both sides, but it will look jarring like that. It's so fast. Just adjust until it looks good, okay? If this video has been helpful to you, go ahead and hit that like button. I would really appreciate it. But if you don't have extra frames, there's a workaround. Be sure your plate's at the middle so you don't have to look for it, okay? And then select your clip and then hit Option G to compound the clip and hit OK. And then hit B to trim your clip and then insert your transition by hitting Command T. Now you can have a transition without extra frames, okay? Nice, right? Thank you for watching and I hope you learned something today. If you want to learn more, I've made a video about how to make a reaction video in Final Cut Pro. Click here to check it out.